Night hours after the 86th Texas legislative session came to an end and right before state senators could gavel out of session, a resignation from the Texas Secretary of State, David Whitley, effective immediately. Patrick Perez joins us now with more on his decision. Quita, state senators were supposed to decide whether Whitley would remain on the job before the end of this session, but Whitley did not appear to have any support from Senate Democrats, so that vote never happened. A little more than a month after Governor Greg Abbott swore Whitley in, Whitley caused quite a bit of controversy after questioning the citizenship status of nearly 100,000 registered voters in Texas. It turns out thousands of those voters were actually citizens. Voting rights groups called the botch review unconstitutional. Three federal lawsuits later and Whitley agreed to rescind the list as part of a settlement agreement. Whitley had been serving in his role pending a confirmation by the Senate. He needed two Democratic votes to get confirmed, but when all 12 Senate Democrats say, said they would not support him, the vote never happened and Whitley is now out of a job. Our partners at the, at the Statesman report Whitley submitted his resignation letter earlier today. So what is next for the office of the Secretary of State? Well, Governor Abbott will appoint someone who will serve in the role until the Senate can confirm him or her. That means Abbott can select whomever he wants to serve as the Secretary of State and senators won't have a say in his pick until the next legislative session. That's in 2021. In the studio tonight, I'm Patrick Perez, KVU News.